Hello dear students. Today we are going to begin with a new lesson. Lesson number 8. Rules that keep us safe. Rules that are made are for our safety. And if we will follow them, we will live a safe life. The lesson begins with two friends talking. Pooja says that she tells Ritu that did you hear about Ravi with his brother who met with a bike accident? He is admitted in the hospital in a serious condition. Doctors say that his leg might have to be amputated. His mother and his sister in a very bad condition after hearing this. They were all in tears. The accident occurred when Ravi was riding a bike through a national highway. He turned the bike carelessly near the bookstore. A car which was coming from the opposite side hit the bike and thus the accident occurred. Pooja said this with a very heavy voice and tears in, his, in her eyes. Ritu said, don't you remember the class we had on road safety rules and the reasons for road accidents? There are many rules which the pedestrians and the drivers ought to follow. If we are little careful to follow the rules, we can avoid the accidents. Pooja said, yes, it is correct. Traffic rules are the road maps towards the wellness of people. If we do not keep the rules, the laws we may not be at the safer side but abiding the laws will give us safety traffic laws are the laws which govern traffic and regulate vehicles these rules are not only for the drivers of vehicles children but are also meant for pedestrians cyclists motorcyclists and other road users the proper knowledge of these rules can reduce the number of accidents and thus can establish a healthy and organized traffic system in our country. Let's see about the different traffic rules. The traffic lights. The traffic lights or the traffic signals are used to control the traffic. Traffic lights for vehicles have three colors, red, amber, and green. Traffic lights for pedestrians have two colors, red and green. The drivers as well as the pedestrians must know the meaning. The red light directs us to stop. The amber color light gives time to the vehicles to clear the road when the signal is changing from green to red. And the green color directs us to move forward carefully. The traffic police makes various hand signals to direct the traffic and the traffic police play a very important role in making the moving of vehicles and pedestrians flexible on the road. Road marking. Road marking or the lines on the road indicate a number of meanings to the drivers as well as pedestrians. The road markings are white and yellow color and each type of marking or line has a special meaning. Disobeying the meaning of these markings is an offense and can lead to accidents. Therefore, the basic knowledge of these road markings is essential for the road users. The alternate black and white lines that we see on the road, across the road, are called the zebra crossing or the pedestrian crossing. The pedestrians use this strip, the zebra crossing, to cross the road. We also come across a continuous yellow color line at the edge of road that indicates no vehicle is allowed to park on the side of the road. Now 
let's take a glance at some rules for pedestrians. Are rules obstacles to our freedom? They are people who see rules and regulations as obstacles to their freedom. For such people, keeping the law is very difficult. For example, have you seen keep to the left caption on the staircase? Then we do not take notice of it and start climbing up and down. There will be accidents. Keep to the left rule is to avoid accidents. Rules and regulations are for the good of all of us. It is wrong to think that freedom is to do what we like and not what we don't like. If we keep the law, the law will also keep us.